I'd like to talk today about something that really affects every property owner. It's regarding short-term rentals. So short-term rentals are any rental that's 30 days or less. So it could be one night, two nights, three nights, a week. Anything under 30 days is considered a short-term or transient rental. So whether you are a full-time resident, an investor, or a second home property owner, you use your house sometimes, but live someplace else. These rules and regulations uh, that are dictated by the state and local municipalities affect you. So it's really important to understand, understand these laws and how they affect your property value and your use of your property. So let's just talk about uh, one of the things. Uh, first of all, you maybe don't even realize this, but there's hundreds of properties on websites like Airbnb and VRBO in your municipality. Bettner has over 400 properties on Airbnb alone. That doesn't even include like Facebook and Nextdoor and other websites where you could, Craigslist, where you can advertise your property. So, so there's really hundreds of properties out there doing short-term rentals right in your municipality and could be right next door to you. Maybe you've noticed some of them and haven't been too happy, or maybe you're an investor and it's been working out great for you. Whatever it is, you need to understand how the laws affect you. So basically, each municipality can dictate um, how to interpret the state law, and some have put limitations on these short-term rentals. Right now, Ventner has no limit. Ventner has no limit on the number of days that you can rent your property. So it could be one night, two nights, a week, whatever it is. Ventner has no limitations. Right now, Margate, it has to be a minimum of a week. So seven days or more is what Margate's dictating. And a lot of the other local municipalities, it's about two or three nights. So a weekend basically is the minimum. Ventner is looking to get your input on whether they should restrict this short-term rental policy. They are having a meeting February 9th, that's a Thursday, at 5.30 p.m. in City Hall, and they wanna hear what you have to say. So I greatly encourage you to go and speak your mind about what it is that, that you wanna talk about regarding short-term rentals. If you're an investor, you probably don't want any limitations and wanna be able to rent your property as much as possible. If you're a property owner who, who lives here or comes down through the summer, again, you might have a voice about any kind of limitations. If you have any questions about your property value, other rules and laws and regulations that affect you as a property owner, or basically just want to know what's going on in the local market, as always, I'm happy to answer your questions. Again, my name is Sherry Lillianfeld, and I'm with eXp Realty. And you can reach me at Sherry, S-H-E-R-R-I, at apexprime.com, or call me on my cell phone. I'm always happy to take the call and answer your questions. 609-287-1795. Thanks so much.